Hello guys. And welcome back to another Kids Connect video. Today we're going to learn about one of nature's most violent and awesome phenomena, volcanoes. Keep watching for amazing facts. The name volcano, has its origin in the name of Vulcan, a god of fire in Roman mythology. A volcano is a mountain where hot liquid rock, called lava, comes from a magma chamber in the Earth's mantle. Most volcanoes have a volcanic crater at the top, called a caldera, with a pipe that leads deep down into the Earth. They can be one of three types, a cinder cone volcano, a composite volcano, or a shield volcano. When a volcano is active, material pours out of it. This includes lava, steam, gases like sulfur, as well as ash, and broken rock pieces. As pressure in the molten rock builds up, it needs to escape somewhere. So it forces its way up through fissures, which are narrow cracks in the Earth's crust. Once the magma erupts through the Earth's surface, its name changes to lava. Magma is liquid rock inside a volcano. Fresh lava ranges from 1,300 degrees to 2,200 degrees Fahrenheit. It's so hot that it glows red and white as it flows. Volcanoes are like giant safety valves that release the pressure that builds up inside the Earth. Most volcanoes will form over many thousands of years. Although, some can appear very quickly. For example, the volcano, Piricutin, appeared in a Mexican field in 1943 and grew to 60 feet in a week. Within a year, Piricutin was 1,000 feet tall. Over half of the world's volcanoes can be found in a belt around the Pacific Ocean, called the Ring of Fire. This is because the Earth's crust is made up of huge slabs called plates, which fit together like a jigsaw puzzle. When these plates move apart or a plate slides under another one, magma can be squeezed out. A volcano can be either active, dormant, or extinct. An active volcano is classified as one that has erupted in the last 1,000 years, and is likely to erupt again. A dormant volcano is one that has not erupted in the last 1,000 years, and may erupt again someday but no one can be sure. An extinct volcano is unlikely to erupt again. Did you know that nearly 5 million people around the world live around volcanoes? Why would anyone do that? Well, volcanic ash is very good for farmlands and the surrounding areas. The nutrients present in volcanic ash, help to make the land very fertile, which means more food for the local inhabitants. In areas with high volcanic activity, like Iceland, the heat from volcanoes is also used to produce hot water, and to run geothermal power plants. And in Japan, it is common for people to bathe in warm volcanic sand. They believe it has healing qualities for certain illnesses and skin conditions. Volcanoes are also responsible for bringing us one of the world's most precious gems. Diamonds. A rare kind of magma called kimberlite comes to the surface to become a diamond. But not all volcanoes produce diamonds, only ones with a special vent called a diatreme. One of the most famous examples in the world, is the Kimberley Hole in South Africa. Let's learn some other cool volcano facts. Both Hawaii and Iceland are volcanic islands. And they have black beaches. The sand on these islands is made when the hot lava cools down. It turns into a type of rock, called basalt. Over time, the rock erodes to create very dark sand. The 1883 eruption of the volcano Krakatoa, was a deadly event that killed around 36,000 people. The eruption was one of the loudest sounds ever made. Scientists say it had the strength of 15,000 nuclear bombs. You've probably also heard about the lost city of Pompeii, which was destroyed by the eruption of Mount Vesuvius in 79 AD. It buried the whole city and turned it into a time capsule that archaeologists use for research. Indonesia has the most active volcanoes in the world. There are about 160 of them. In the United States, Mount St. Helens had a massive eruption on March 27, 1980. It blew away half the mountain and caused pyroclastic flows, which are like avalanches but with mud, ash, and rock. Today, there are as many as 100 active volcanoes in the US. The one most likely to erupt is Mount Rainier in Washington state. Did you know that there could be more than 10,000 volcanoes under the sea? We're discovering more every day. If you enjoyed learning about volcanoes, be sure to visit Kids Connect for hundreds of educational topics and fun activities on other natural phenomena like earthquakes, tsunamis, tectonic plates, and more. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel to be the first to know about new content. See you in the next video.